Uh, now, the, the Chevrolet Traverse itself has uh, always ranked in the top 10 best sellers. Uh, I think Mayor Shaw uh, mentioned that. And at a point in time, there were up to 50 different competitors in this segment. So uh, to be in the top 10 was, uh, was good. Um, but we'd like to improve on that and uh, make sure that our performance continues with the positive momentum that we've got at the moment. Now, since its debut in 2009, I, I can tell you that we built 1.65 million traverses. 1.65 million, that's, uh, that's a lot of traverses, so that's awesome. Uh, certainly from my perspective, there's absolutely no doubt that the Traverse will be one of the best selling nameplates uh, for, for Chevrolet. So from that point of view, it's got a huge opportunity moving forward. And likewise, we've got you know, great ambitions for the platform mates uh, to the Traverse in terms of the, the Buick Enclave and the GMC Acadia as well. Now, we actually expect that demand is going to be super strong. Uh, I've given you some of the sound bites, 55% up in the first half of the year, growing segment, et cetera, et cetera. And with that, we expect to be able to add a third shift next year here at Lansing Doughty Township. So again, superb. I think you look at the vehicle, it's completely redesigned from, from the ground up. Um, it's very much meant uh, to be engineered and designed to look much more like a like a truck, so act more like a truck, as we'll see in the Z71 here. The designers did a great job balancing, you know, crossover cues as well as some truck-inspired design elements, uh, and the Traverse more rugged than ever, ever before here, um, with the first ever Z71 uh, nameplate. Now, safety is certainly important to our customers and certainly paramount to our owners of Traverse. We will offer more safety features than ever before here, driver assistance features, uh, including Chevy Safety Assist as standard across the board, and new features like rear park assist and side bicyclist alert. Now, we all know the number one thing that we can do to protect ourselves in a crash, or our families in a crash, our passengers in a crash, is to wear seatbelts. And that's why we've updated the buckle to drive feature on the new Traverse, which now requires both the front passenger as well as the driver to be buckled uh, before you drive. And for the first time ever on Traverse, we will have rear seatbelt reminders for the driver. So they'll know whether their passengers are buckled in or not. Now Super Cruise is also available on most models here. This is a new technology uh, in the Traverse lineup. Um, includes automatic lane change capability and trailering capability. It's a proven technology. It's been in the market since 2017 with more than 77 million miles driven by customers using Super Cruise so far. Now the all new 24 Traverse, we are redefining its role and capability and that's going to put more Traverses in more driveways um, very soon. So we're proud to recognize the women and men here um, who have built more than 1.65 million units at, uh, um, Rory talked about earlier, right here in Michigan and been doing it since 2009.